Hi everyone, welcome back to Zeman Outdoors. Today I'm going to go through what I use for hog bait and it works very well. So you'll need a bag of corn, a five gallon bucket with a lid, two packs of jello, three packages of yeast. They didn't have just little packets so I had to buy a, a bag of it and it was, this is about seven to eight teaspoons. And then a two liter fruit soda. And so I'm going to go ahead and show you how I mix it up and then at the end I'll show you how it works. So you're going to take your five gallon bucket. Oof, man that stinks. So I haven't cleaned this since last time I did it so it's going to smell extra good. So fill the bucket halfway with corn. Add your 78 teaspoons of yeast. Add your two packets of jello. Then add your two liter soda. Then you fill the bucket up with water. Once you fill it with water, you're going to want to put the lid on and let it sit for three to four days before you use it. You want to keep the lid cracked because the yeast is going to have to expand and the air is gonna to have to push out somewhere. Another option is drilling holes in the top of the lid. However, I wanna be able to transport this in my truck, and so I don't want it to spill if it tips over. So I'm just gonna leave it cracked and let it sit for three to four days. First, you're gonna to wanna to go ahead and dig a hole or two, 12 to 18 inches deep, or as deep as your soil will allow. And you're gonna to wanna to fill these holes with a little bit of your sour corn mixture and then take your dirt that you just pulled out of those holes and put it right back over top your sour corn mixture. You're gonna to wanna to do this because it helps keep the hogs in the area longer. It makes them dig for the corn. They may tear it up a little bit, but it'll keep them there and hopefully you can get a good shot on them. I also like to pour a little bit of corn on the top and this will help attract the hogs to the area and then the holes will help keep them in the area. One benefit to the sour corn too is that Deer, squirrels, and other varmints don't tend to like it. So really you're just attracting the hogs 